Welcome to our nematology practical lecture. Our practical will focus on morphological identification of juvenile for cyst nematode using a microscope. The objective of this practical is to identify the cyst nematode juvenile based on morphological features, thus enabling us to differentiate it from the juvenile of root knot nematode. The different features include its appearance. The juvenile is vermiform with no defined reproductive structures. It also has a strong restricturized labial region with a strong cephalic framework. Its stylet is robust and strongly restricturized with larger basal knobs when compared to the juvenile of root knot nematode. The juvenile also has an elongated tail with a longer clear region called the hyaline region. This region covers around half of the tail from its tail tip. After this brief recap, let's now start off with our practical exercise. Let us start by putting our nematode specimen in the focus. Right now what we are seeing is the rabio region of this cyst nematode juvenile. This rabio region is high and strongly skeletized with a strong spheric framework. In the same focus, we also have the stylet of this nematode. This stylet is robust and strongly skeletized. Within the same field, we can also see the stylet basal knobs, which are larger when compared to those of the root knot nematode juvenile. When we move posteriorly, we can also see the usual structures, such as the median bulb, the entire pharyngeal region, and the secretory excretory power. From around the midboard of this nematode, up to almost the start of the tail, we see that this region is covered by the intestines with no defined reproductive structures. As we come to the posterior end, we come across the tail of this nematode. This tail is elongate with a longer hyaline region. As we can see from the specimen, the hyaline region takes about a half of the tail from its tail tip. From this microscopy practical exercise, we have seen the different diagnostic features for the cyst nematode juvenile, and thus being able to differentiate it from the root knot nematode juvenile. Thank you all for watching, and please check our YouTube channel for more videos of other nematodes.